Hey guys, thanks for joining me for another episode. We're going to be talking about Evelyn Lozada and what she just created. Now, she is one of the stars of Basketball Wives, and she just recently posted that she's created an OnlyFans account where fans can pay to look at her feet up close and personal. Okay. Now, people have the right to do whatever they want to do as long it is, as it is legal. I get it. Um, but this is my question. What won't people pay for when it comes to these celebrities? I'm like sitting here scratching my head and I definitely won't know what her feet look like because I, one, don't even have an OnlyFans account let alone will I sign up to check out somebody's feet, but I mean to each their own. But the fact that people are paying for this is what is like making me say what in the world, but I'll be honest, I feel like she's thinking, you know what, there's some idiots out here in the world who will pay for anything just because I am who I am. So let me test it out. Let me create an OnlyFans account, create a post on my Instagram and see if people will actually fall for this. So she posted a boomerang video of her toes manicured, of course. <laughs> And then she says, follow my foot journey and more on my OnlyFans account. Click the link in the bio. And then she's got some ankle bracelets on. And then she says, you can buy them on her website. Well, a lot of people went crazy and they just started giving her like mad props and kudos and people have started signing up for it. So this is not a joke. She is charging $25 a month for the exclusive content and she's already started getting a lot of people subscribing and is making a lot of money within hours of starting the page. What is wrong with people? <laughs> what is wrong with people? This is like insane to me. And again, like I said, people have the right to like what they wanna like and do what they wanna do, but to pay $25 a month to check out her feet, why but this goes back to my theory that celebrities can pretty much break wind in a jar cap it and say that they're selling this new fragrance for 49.99 and people will buy it because the celebrity has bottled up their own farts this is just my opinion because that's the way it comes across when i see people just buying whatever these celebrities are selling and it just doesn't make any sense to me but then people who are working hard and striving to make moves in their businesses so that they can sell products that they really truly adore and believe in and they want other people to be able to enjoy them as well they have to go through hoops and hurdles to get people to invest in their products and to and to believe in what they have to offer. So you guys let me know how you feel about it in the comment section. Will you be signing up for her OnlyFans account? I mean, obviously she's a smart businesswoman because she just decided to try something out and she's already making a lot of money doing this. There were people making amazing and, you know, beautiful and comments like that in her Instagram account, but there's a lot of other comments that were like, yeah, her feet may be beautiful, but I'm not paying $25 a month to look at them. There are too many clowns in the world. 
I wouldn't pay $25 a month even if she got naked like Chan Johnson would say, child, please. So I don't know. You guys let me know what you think in the comment section. Do you feel that she's a smart businesswoman? Would you subscribe to her OnlyFans account? And hey, if people were willing to pay you $25 a month to look at your feet, would you create an account to make money? Let me know your thoughts on it in the comment section. Guys, thanks so much for listening to this episode. You can click the links in the description box to check out ways you can support the channel. And I am the Minister of Beauty, here to share the Bible. That's business, inspiration, beauty, life, and enjoyment. So thank you for liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing. And until the next episode, have an amazingly blessed and beautiful day.